biggest fallout from Super Tuesday, former South Carolina Governor Nikki Haley suspending her presidential campaign. This pretty much guarantees former President Donald Trump will be the Republican presidential nominee. And Terrence is here with more. Yes, yeah, she lost every state but one to former President Donald Trump on Super Tuesday. Yet yeah, she says she's holding her head up high. Uh, the question now, though, where will her supporters go from here? At the start of the race, she had pledged to support any candidate who wins the Republican nomination. But in her exit speech today, she wished Trump well. She stopped short of an outright endorsement, though. I wish anyone well who would be America's president. Our country is too precious to let our differences divide us. I have always been a conservative Republican and always supported the Republican nominee. But on this question, as she did on so many others, Margaret Thatcher provided some good advice when she said, quote, never just follow the crowd, always make up your own mind. It is now up to Donald Trump to earn the votes of those in our party and beyond it who did not support him. President Biden reacted to the news saying there is a place for Haley supporters in his campaign, while Trump is also welcoming them, insisting Biden is the enemy. Scott.